Hey guys, Bruno here. Today I'm going to introduce you to the new iPhone, the iPhone with the most complicated name so far, the iPhone XS Max. Was I the only one who thought this was called the iPhone XS Max? <laughs> Hope not. As you can see, it's a pretty cool. This is the gold one. The only not so cool thing about this is the price, $1,100. When they introduce you to this, they say, oh, this is the iPhone with the largest display ever made. And you say, oh, cool. And this also has like uh, the fastest face ID. And you say, oh, even cool. And then they say the cheapest price for this is uh, $1,100. And then you have a heart attack. <laughs> you know, you can buy a car for that, <laughs> that much money. First of all, let's talk a bit about this face ID thing. I love it, right? But what if someone looks just like you? He can steal your iPhone. What if you have a twin brother? Or what if someday I just change everything in my face, you know, I become blonde and I, I dye everything and I have a plastic surgery, I won't be able to open my iPhone anymore. It's really sad. <laughs> Once you get this iPhone, you should keep the same face every day. Because what if you're in danger someday and you like put your face to it and it doesn't recognize you? You're in trouble. You know what they say, you always have to prepare for the worst, but Anyway, let's try the face ID. Set up face ID. Get started. Move your head slowly, it says, to complete the circle. Moving my head slowly. Oops, got blurry. Move your head slowly to pull the circle. I just finished setting up the face ID and it's pretty cool, I have to say. So look, here's the iPhone. You swipe up. There's nothing, right? It requires face ID. I put it here. Whoops, it opened up. You can't see, but it opened up. <laughs> face ID, I have to say, me gusta mucho. But uh, it's scary though, right? How a simple iPhone can recognize your face. Like, where are we going? They'll just put a camera on you and they'll know who you are, what you do, you know, what did you eat for breakfast, everything. I have to break this iPhone. <laughs> You know what the face ID is good for if you have a grandma who doesn't see that well. And you know someone else goes to her and he's like, hey, I'm your nephew. Well, let me check. And she just show, puts his iPhone on his face. And the iPhone recognizes, is, is it her nephew or not? And you know, you might be a bad person. You might do bad things to your grandma. <laughs> grandma has a lot of money. You know, she has saved all her life jewelry and by the way you should get those and sell those because uh, grandma doesn't need them. it's not like she'll take them with her you know so like i mentioned before uh this has the largest display ever made on an iphone and it's mainly because it doesn't have a button and when you compare it to my uh, iphone 8 plus c my iphone 8 plus has a, a button here which kind of takes a lot of space uh these are i mean like this, they're the same in size, kind of. Uh, this has a case also, it makes it look a bit bigger. Let's watch two YouTube videos of the best YouTube star, the most talented, which is me. <laughs> All right, so let me show you two iPhones. What can a man want more from life? Nothing, just two iPhones. So, see, now it's a, uh, oh man, I don't know where to move this. Anyway, see, now it's kind of the same. But the thing that this one has is that you can zoom it a bit more and now it kind of cuts a bit, right? But, uh, what do you want? Yeah, I don't know how to navigate this new one. I feel like a grandma. You know, when you give your grandma a new iPhone, she's like, how do I do this? Let's go cook, grandma. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go cook me something. But, uh, so look, oops, now it has less space. You see the black areas at the side of it? Now it has more space, but it also cuts a bit at the top. So, uh, you know, yeah, it's a bigger screen, but $1,100, man. So far, I'm not really impressed, you know, but that's because I had the iPhone 8 Plus and my iPhone is pretty good, you know, I love my iPhone, it's really fast. And they say that this new one is faster, but how much faster can it get? I mean, mine is super fast. I mean, I would call this faster only if it would open Facebook with 
you know, before I even think about it, you know, like I think, oh, I want Facebook open, boom, it opens. That's how it would be faster for my iPhone 8 Plus, because like I said, it's pretty fast. Everyone wants speed today, make that pie, but I want it fast. Make that hamburger, but I want it quick, okay? Because I want to get fat quick. <laughs> I don't want to wait 10 minutes to get fat. I want it now. Now let's check out the reason that most people get these new iPhones, the camera quality. I have a bad news for you. The camera, you know, if you're ugly, it will make you look ugly and it doesn't make you look beautiful. And you know, people want this uh, high quality cameras. They want to see the details. But why you want that? I mean, you, you have a pimple here. You want everyone to see that? You know, when you have a bad quality camera, your face looks like clear, like a supermodel. <laughs> when you have a high quality one, People can see your pimples, everything, your scars. You like Scarface? I like him. I mean, yeah, why, why am I even talking about Scarface? So to test the quality of it, I'm gonna take some selfies from uh, here where I am. I'm gonna put them there in the video. And I know when you see the selfies and uh, pictures, you're gonna be like, oh, that iPhone takes amazing pictures. We should get that. No, 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 it's not the iPhone. It's just me, okay? It's <laughs> It's just how my mom made, okay? <laughs> it's not the iPhone. So I, I just took some pictures with both of these and I have to say I'm not like extremely impressed. Actually, I think my iPhone 8 Plus takes better pictures. But that's mainly because I love it, you know? If everyone says this uh, 10S Max takes better pictures, it takes better pictures. But probably it's because my iPhone also loves me a lot. So it's like, I know you, Bruno. I don't know what you want to look like. Well, this new one uh, doesn't know me yet. I have to say. I'm looking at the specifications right now. It has dual 12 megapixels rear cameras. Uh, I don't know what that means, but <laughs> but it sounds good, you know. 1.8 wide le angle lens. You know, who cares? I mean, I only care. It does it take a good picture or doesn't take a good picture. It also says here that it has exceptional materials, the most durable glass ever in a smartphone. Let's try it. Uh, I need a hammer right now. Or you know what? I'm just going to throw it down right here. Were you really thinking, you know, I was going to do that with a $1,100 iPhone? Who do you think I am? Bill Gates? I wouldn't break a $1 iPhone. It has custom OLED displays. This, it has the cu the custom o oh, the custom OLED displays on the iPhone XS. Deliver the most accurate colors in the industry, HDR and true blacks. Well, that's cool, assuming you don't have, you know, vision problems. Because if you can't see it, you can't see it, it's not the iPhone. You need glasses. <laughs> Here's a picture of me that has different colors. Judging uh, from my vision, which is pretty good, I have to say I do not need glasses. Not yet, at least. <laughs> but, uh, you know, you, you can't tell a difference because, like I said, I have the iPhone 8 Plus. If you have like a Samsung from 2003, this is gonna be like, you know, you're gonna be like, this can't be real, this iPhone is so good. But I have that one, it's pretty good, so I don't really see like a huge difference. I mean, Apple is amazing, don't get me wrong, I love Apple. I love Apple, the company, I love eating apples, you know. They're so healthy, they keep you away from a doctor. Let me tell you a joke about Apple. So there's two women having a conversation, and one says to the other, you know, I love apples because they keep me away from the doctor. And the other woman says, Jennifer, what are you talking about? Your husband is a doctor. <laughs> I hope you got that. If you didn't get it, it means that, you know, she didn't want, she didn't like her husband. So that's why she ate the apple. So she wanted to stay away from him. It's also water and dust resistant. I mean, these old iPhones were as well. I mean, some of them. But this one, it's even better, okay? It's even more durable. So if you see like a lake and you see a duck and you say like, oh, I love the duck. I want to get that and eat it <laughs> or cook it home. You don't have to take out the iPhone, put it somewhere, you know, jump with the iPhone. Who lives in such a big dust and they need dust resistant iPhones? If there's a lot of dust, 
tell your mom, your grandma to clean the house. You know, you don't need the dust resist on iPhone. Just, just clean the house. It also says that the new iPhone has super fast download speeds. So, uh, you guys, if you want to download stuff, you know, everyone knows what guys like to download from the internet. <laughs> Oh man, that's so sad. So the biggest one is 512 gigabytes of storage. I don't know why a man would need so much. If you need so much storage, you have issues, man. You need a doctor, you need help. Or you, you do like, you know, high level job, like uh, you sell movies. <laughs> so guys, that was my introduction to the iPhone XS Max. This is the gold. It doesn't look like gold, right? As you saw, this video wasn't so much about the iPhone because you know, I don't really care about like this new specification. I, I got other stuff to do. You know, we went from the new iPhone from making jokes about that woman who didn't like her husband and you know, she ate apple so she kept him away because he was a doctor and apples keep you away from the doctors whatever i hope you enjoyed my video and oh would i recommend you to get this one i mean depending on how much money you have on your bank account don't get a loan to buy it okay don't get a loan don't make that mistake but if you have money and you're either thinking of uh, uh, i don't know buying something really really stupid and this thing just buy this thing What's something really stupid you can do with your money? If you're thinking of throwing your money in the ocean, because some guy told you that if you throw money in the ocean, good things are gonna come to you, then don't do that by this new iPhone, okay? By the way, what happened to the iPhone 9? iPhone 8? Why is this 10? Oh, these guys forgot. Someone should send them an email. What happened to the iPhone 9? Remember to be grateful with what you have right now because that's how good things come to you, okay? Even if you have a Samsung, a flip phone, or you have no phone at all, which, you know, it's, it's better for some things. Like, these phones are ruining our life. Like, we're like this, okay? Like, I see people now, their spines is like this, you know, because they're always on the iPhone. Guys, thanks a lot for watching this video. I hope I, I hope. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, you know you buy it you don't buy it. I don't win anything but uh, do whatever you want okay just follow your heart where is it here his heart is in the middle remember to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel you, you know because if I get a lot of views I get famous I can keep up with the new iPhones every year you want that right and I'm gonna be taking some cool pictures with this uh, new iPhone although I I already told you the camera doesn't look like a like a huge quality difference from my iPhone but I'm gonna take some for you to see okay just for you not your brother not your grandma not your sister just you okay <laughs> just for you thanks a lot for watching give a thumbs up subscribe to my channel